you big gray squirrel. You have to see this. Ah, uh, nothing impresses me anymore. All right, watch this. <laughs> no way! Treasure X King's gold is the best! Nom 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 nom! Told ya! Squirrel Stampede! Please like and subscribe! I'm not afraid of the mummy's curse. On the table, Treasure X King's gold! Treasure Tomb! Complete 30 levels of adventure to find treasure. Dig up the beasts, release the king, crack open the vault, find guaranteed real gold dipped treasure, guaranteed. On the back of the box, the contents of this massive playset. Conquer the tomb to unlock the treasure. Can you survive the treasure tomb and find the king's gold? Crack open the golden skull to begin the ultimate treasure X experience. Dig out the beasts guarding the entrance, but beware of hidden traps. Unlock the king's tomb to reveal a bounty of riches. Are you worthy to take on the ultimate quest for treasure? Look at all the levels of play for your Treasure X hunters. Multiple things to do inside. Inside the box, we find our mighty treasure tomb. Excavator tool and a treasure tomb guide. Who needs a guide when you're a squirrelologist? That's right, squirrel. And my squirrel instincts say, to get into this tomb, we break apart the golden skull's glasses. We'll use this X tool, and away we go. Causing some serious damage here. Maybe I should use the poker. What? Spider, careful in there. Correction, scorpion. A scorpion is basically just a squirrel without any fur, when you think about it. Interesting factoid, squirrelologist. All right, my next instincts say we must eye gouge the skull to unlock the tomb, of course. Three Stooges style, of course. <coughs> think we've unlocked it. And eye gouge all the way up. We have now officially entered the treasure tomb. Any squirrelologist would tell you an incredibly difficult tale. Inside we see several levels of play. The main floor reveals several tombs and traps. We move up to a second floor tomb and up to a very fancy purple dollar sign chair. I see this ladder here. May help you on your way. Methinks we begin with these small tombs up front. What do you think, Squirrel? Me also thinks we should begin there, me thinks. Okay, let's do that. Treasure number one. It appears very ancient, perhaps mini-beast-like. How do we get inside? Perhaps on the bottom. You must squirrel crow bar it with your tail. Nicely done. Looks like we return to the new magic blue rock dig. A very interesting and dangerous compound. Let's use our X tool and dig. Think I may have found it. Inside the Rice crispy Rock Treat. There, there is our first capture. If you have not had a chance yet to play with the new rock compound, it is quite fun. Quite crumbly, but yet also compoundy. Now to unwrap our mini beast. 
our mini beast crumbles out. It's gold! Looks like we must rebuild! Wise observation, Squirrelologist. Let's rebuild. Behold, a Squirrelologist, a beautiful golden mini beast dragon. Those wings are quite haunting, aren't they, Squirrel? The small mini beast dragon has a locket around its neck and is very, very gold. Behold, human Squirrelologist! A key! A key! Well done, Squirrelologist! That key will help us dig deeper into the treasure tomb. But first, let's untomb the second mini beast. I could use the help of your squirrel tail crowbar again. Can do! And we dig again. And behold, our next wrapped beast. This time we have uncovered the golden mini beast crocodile. Almost squirrel like. Hey, look, another key. Well done, squirrelologist. I believe we may now have enough keys to continue our quest. My instincts tell me that these keys will release the treasures underneath the mini beasts. Let me see one of those keys, Squirrel. And we will go right here with our first mini beast. <laughs> Whoa! We have found a treasure! The King's Golden Sword! Exhilarating! And for our second treasure, Squirrel. Oh, ah! Snakely and beetle things! Snakely and beetle things! Ah. <laughs> You're right, Squirrelologist. I must be brave to get that treasure. Let's let's open one more time. Ah, yee! Don't bite me! Ah, yee! Oh. Whew! We have found it, the Crystal Crest! Let's quickly remove the key so that those vaults will never open again. This is quite the adventure so far, Squirrelologist. Yes, you are right. It is time to insert the King's Sword into the X-Stone. And... <gasps> Behold the King's Tomb! Removing now. The artismanship is beyond words. Look at the cover of the king's tomb as he rests in pieces. Removing the lid. It has been boarded up through time. Using our excavator tool, we will smash through it. Always so satisfying. Now just remove the planks to the sea of blue fish tank rock. Somewhere inside is our king. Somewhere. Now we may unwrap again. And our king uncovered from his tomb. Might possibly be one of the greatest treasure ex hunter kings exhumed on this channel. Would you like to hold your sword, king? He would. 
What a fantastic figure. We also have his golden shield. You're right, Squirrelologist. Our next key to this enormous puzzle. Now we take the king's shield and the crystal crest and place them together. What a fantastic treasure. And we can now move on to the epic back vault. My research gathered says hold the shield from the handle and insert the X into the vault door. Turn the shield to the right. Ah, a drop! Yikes! Uh, 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 uh. Oops, don't turn the shield to the right. Turn the shield to the left. Ah! Ah! Behold, the king's gold. <clears throat> the king's gold. Hooray! We have found the king's crown with the real gold treasure. Golden coins. More golden coins with more treasure. A king's birdie. A king's dagger. Finally, a king's royal axe thingy. That is a worthy treasure. Now we may crown our king once again and equip him for battle. Truly magnificent, fantastic golden detail on that crown medallion. Let us place him on his throne. What a comfortable chair for our king. But wait, the king is angry. If he feels someone is getting too close to the treasure, he may release the trapdoor lever. Where's that? I think it's right behind the king. Uh, Squirrelologist, you might not want to be on that ladder. What? Ah! Nice catch, Squirrelologist. This place is kind of a death trap. Yeah, we best be more careful. Maybe we take a moment to look at the storage options on this right side wall. You can store your weapons there. Also, if the king allows, push the sword into the X stone to activate the spring loaded vice trap. And you may trap someone. Or, raise this red bridge behind the trap, rest on top of the vice trap. Pushing the sword into the X stone also activates the bridge drop. Uh, I'm done here. When you declare your expedition finally over, you may return your tombs for safekeeping. If you wish, you may remove the vault and store your treasure inside or keep inside the main tomb. Store your treasure X figures inside and seal the tomb. It's still a little tricky to figure out how to do that. Open again if you dare. And there we have it, Squirrel. Our quest is at an end. Aww, I'm sad. I'm not. We found gold dip treasure. Come on, let's go get some ice cream. Oh, cool. When you put it that way. Can I have some ice cream too? Treasure X, King's Gold, Treasure Tomb, arrives on store shelves fall 2019. The adventure runs approximately $50. However, with real guaranteed gold dipped treasure, you may be able to finance some of the adventure. If you're a big fan of Treasure X, King's Gold, this large treasure tomb playset has loads of opportunity and stages of fun. 
Just be careful of the terrifying traps, as they may curse you for years to come. That's what I have to say about that. Oh great, I think we all just got squirrel cursed. Thanks for watching Squirrel Stampede. Please, like, share, subscribe.